Here's the video I created using DZI's video lip sync feature. AI lip sync has reached the next level. They don't just speak, they speak and move together. Across languages, across universes. Stick around to learn how to make your own lip synced videos. Hey, it's Mia. In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to make natural speaking videos like this using design for your own projects. Let's get started. In today's workflow, we're going to do this in three simple steps. First, we create an image to set the scene. Second, we'll turn the image into a video. And finally, we'll add lip sync to the video. Let's start by creating our image using the text to image tool. This is going to be the foundation of our entire lip sync video, so we want to get it right. First, select your preferred style. Both realistic and animated characters can work well with the lip sync feature, so you can have your pick. Next, we need to enter the prompt. Since we need clear facial feature for lip sync to work well, I specify a close-up shot and describe the facial features in details. I also select the HD mode because higher quality images give us much better results in the animation and lip sync steps. Everything is set, let's click generate. I generated a few options and this one has clear facial features and great lighting and also visible lips. This can work well with the lip sync. So I'll send this to the canvas. And before animating the image, I like to make sure the image quality is good. So I normally enhance the image quality first with the Enhance and Upscale tool. Select Portrait since we're working with a human face. And then select your preferred strength option. Now the details are much more refined. After the enhancement, send the enhanced result to the canvas or download for the next step. Next step is image to video. Now let's bring the image to life. Head over to AI video and select image to video. First, we'll pick a video model. We've got many video model options to choose from. Each one has different costs and capabilities. You can see a brief highlights of what each model is best for while you hover over them. Some give you longer durations and some give you camera controls. Some have start and aim frame for better control. I'm going with clean 2.0 because the video quality is the best. But at the same time, it costs you more credits than others. Next, we'll select our enhanced image as the starting frame. You can choose the image from the canvas we sent it to earlier or upload directly from your computer. Now here's where you describe what you want to happen. We want to keep it simple and specific. Something like, the man is talking to the camera while cooking. Down here, we can set the imagination slider. We can slide it to the right for accuracy and relevancy to your prompt and left for more creative interpretation. I'll put it in the middle for now. And then we'll select the duration. I think five seconds is good enough for this clip. And here you will see the credit cost for this generation. Click generate to create a video. The result looks pretty good. We want natural movement that can fit with speaking. And this one is great. His face is clear and his lips are visible to the camera. This is exactly what we need for great lip sync material. And now we're ready for lip sync. Click the lip sync tool to enter the lip sync panel. Next, we need to upload either a face image or video. We want to upload the video we just created. To send the video to the panel, we can either directly upload a video file from the computer or click lip sync under the video in the result panel. Next, let's create the voice. Click pick a voice and there are two options text to speech or upload your own audio. Let's try the text to speech first. First, we enter what we want our characters to say. Next, we can select the voice. There are many language options and for each language, there are different voice options for us to choose from. We can click preview to listen. The people who are crazy enough to think they can change the world are the ones who do. I think this is a really nice way to just talk naturally together. You know, talk plainly. Hold on to your hats, folks, because the news coming out from NVIDIA today is going to blow you away. Here we can adjust the speed of the speech. If it goes over the video duration a bit, you can adjust the speed faster and see if it can fit the duration better. Click play audio to create and listen to the text to speech audio preview. The secret of this recipe is a pinch of salt and 
a lot of love. I think this one sounds good. You can see the duration of the speech here. Seems a bit short. I like to adjust the speed to create something closer to the five second duration. And now it's perfect. Also, the punctuation and the ways you write your text prompt can actually affect the results. Let me try a few as examples. This is the original. The secret of this recipe is a pinch of salt and a lot of love. This is removing the three dots. The secret of this recipe is a pinch of salt and a lot of love. This is to add only two dots. The secret of this recipe is a pinch of salt and a lot of love. Can you hear the differences? After we get a satisfying result, hit generate to sync the voice to the video. And here's the result. The secret of this recipe is a pinch of salt and a lot of love. Let's try to lip sync this video with the audio upload option. And I want to see if we can make her sing. So I created an AI song and used CapCut Cut to isolate just the vocal track so it's easier for lip sync. You can use any stem splitting software to easily isolate any vocal. And we'll upload the vocals for this input. After uploading the audio, we see that the audio is actually 7.1 seconds, but our video is only 5 seconds long. Ideally, I should have created a longer video to match the audio length, but since the system allows it, let's see what happens. And here's the result. This is my moment, I'm taking the chance With every pattern lost in this dance we see that the video actually loops back to accommodate the longer audio. This actually looks pretty cool. The lip sync still look natural, even with the extended duration. And this clip could easily fit into a Disney style music video. What if you have multiple characters in one scene? I'm actually surprised it can work well with multi-character scenes as well. The process is basically the same. Upload your video. And when the system detects multiple characters, It'll prompt you to select which person you want to lip sync to. Then we can lip sync the character just like we did before. I need to go to the ladies room before the show. Can you make sure the popcorn is still here when I'm back? Again? Told you not to drink the Slurpee before the movie. Not just English. These are some languages I've tried. Bonjour, mademoiselle. Comment puis-je vous aider aujourd'hui? No se preocupen. Todo está bajo control. 나를 좋아해요? 예, 아니면 아니요에 체크해 주세요. 내심 빙진의 미주에 사오칸 소지 도화차. Now it's your turn to get creative. Try it out using the link below, and we can't wait to see what you come up with. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Happy creating!